How far are you willing to go? How far are you willing to allow yourself to be stretched to the point where you feel like it's no return? It's so hard. You know, I had all of this planned out where I was going to have a beautiful background and really be able to walk you through my journey as I talk about what it really means to impact others. And of course, it didn't go the way that I wanted it to go. I had different things that I was dealing with. I wanted to do it on my lunch break. I wanted to do it after work, but I ran out of time. And that is something that happens a lot in entrepreneurship where you are constantly battling time. Of course, there are times where you can prepare ahead. And then there are other times where you just have to go. You have to be on. You can't have everything perfectly the way you want it to go. The tech is going to give you issues. Sometimes you don't know what to say, but you know that you want to show up. And that is something that resonates with me deeply. Last year, I remember trying to go live at a beautiful place where water was running by and it was a beautiful boardwalk, but my tech was old and I wasn't able to update my phone and go live. So it kept pausing every time I tried to get my message out. And that's how life is a lot where there are certain times where you feel like you are silenced, where you feel like you are unable to really communicate what it is that you really want to say and you might feel as if you have lost people and I want to let you know today that just the aspect of showing up just the beautiful thought to show up is so powerful because it means you're getting there you're getting there closer and I just really think that that is so important for us to understand in this day and age is if you don't get on that wave you'll never get started. If you wait until everything is set in order, everything is in place for you to get started, you're already going to be behind and you may not get the transformation or the success that you are looking for. A lot of those people that you see, those successful people, they are successful today because they simply got started and they refined their process over time. And so, you know, when you come back the next time, you'll do it better because you understand what it means to improve. Practice makes perfect. Practicing and practicing and practicing. And so if you feel as if you are stuck today, you may not be stuck tomorrow. So encourage yourself daily and say in your mind, I'm going to do this today. Today is going to be the day that I do something different that I impact others. That's what it means to me.